Hi, this is problem four from the 2016 AIM. A right prism with height h has bases that are regular hexagons with sides of length 12. Vertex a of the prism and its three adjacent vertices are the vertices of a triangular pyramid. And the dihedral angle formed by the face of the pyramid that lies in the base of the prism and the face of the pyramid that does not contain a measures 60 degrees, find h squared. Okay, so this looks like a three-dimensional geometry problem, so uh, let me try to make a good drawing, and it usually gets me most of the way there. So let me just draw the top of my uh, prism. The bottom. Okay, that looks good. The hexagon has side length 12, has a height h, and we have a vertex a, and uh, looks like we're going to try to form a triangular pyramid with the three vertices that are adjacent to a. Let me draw those in red. That's this vertex, that vertex, and that vertex, and that forms the triangular pyramid shown and it looks like we have a dihedral angle between uh, this face and the base of the prism is 60 degrees so it looks like we should draw the cross section at the midpoint of this line to form this right triangle and then this angle in here is equivalent to the dihedral angle. And we know that that's uh, 60 degrees. So let's break this out a little bit. Let's look at the uh, hexagon at the base. And this line I've drawn runs from this vertex to that vertex. And we know that the side length of our hexagon is 12. So that uh, quickly tells us that uh, this length at the base of our triangle is of length 6. So that's a big help. So we can basically break out this uh, right triangle and show that it's a 60 degree right triangle with a base of 6 hypotenuse of 12. The height then is 6 radical 3, and so h squared is just uh, the square of this, 36 times 3, 108. That's our final answer. Anyway, these problems really hinge upon you visualizing and drawing a clear drawing to get your problem started. And I find if, if I can do this, I can usually solve the problem. So hope that helped, and we'll see you at the next video. Bye-bye.